Hello and welcome to Django tutorial number 30. Today we will aggregate and annotate data. Ok, first we will start the server. Then call the web page. What we will do is, on the archive we will print how many are in archives and for each month. First we will go in the archive view. We create a basic query set that only retrieves data that are published. Then we aggregate the data and get the count. This is an implicit aggregate. Then we want to annotate the data by month. But for that we need first to import backend and connections. To truncate the date to the month we need, we need to involve the database operations and and call the date trunk SQL method. We truncate by month and use the column created. Now we have in month our custom column. With extra we specify our new custom field and the values we tell Django by which column we annotate. Then we call annotate and tell that we wanted to count all the rows. Don't forget to import a count method. And we order the data by our custom field. Now we create a context for our template. And pass it through. Switch to the template and use the data. Keep in mind when you iterate, the objects are dictionaries, not models. And each dictionary will have a count field. Ok, let's try it. Yes, that's what we want. But let's aggregate some more data. We do an explicit aggregate count. And some more stuff. Don't forget to import the new aggregate methods. Keep in mind the return value of aggregate is a dictionary. That looks much better. Thank you for watching. Any feedback is welcome.